When I went in, the gentleman at the door said, you know, I, you're at the wrong building. And I said, no, no, I'm, I'm at the right place. He goes, no, no, the, the nurse is for the COVID testing. <laughs> it's the other building. I said, no, no, I'm, I'm here to apply to be a longshore woman. In August 2021, almost 4.3 million Americans quit their job. The resignation rate hit a 20-year high of 2.9%. Jessica Thomas worked in the restaurant industry for nine years in northern New Jersey before the COVID shutdown left her without a job and a paycheck. But also in that industry, you know, if you're not working, you're not making money. So there are no sick days. There's no vacation time. There's no health insurance. Uncertain of when her job would restart, the mother of three found herself at home relying on unemployment benefits. Her husband, Derek, who works as a bartender, faced a similar dilemma. A lot of people took the time that, you know, when you had the time off and you were sitting home collecting unemployment, they took the time to find other careers. I didn't hear anything from the owner until I think it was a day before when he was going to, okay, we're reopening. There was no communication, nothing. So for me, that kind of just made me want to get out of that industry. On the advice of her brother-in-law, Jessica applied for a job at the port of Newark, New Jersey, home to the East Coast's busiest port. Her new day-to-day -day duties include loading and unloading cargo ships that bring in electronics, apparel, and consumer goods from around the world. Monday, I drove 1,700 Toyotas off of a ship. We got there at 7 a.m., we got done at 5, and you drive the car off, get back in the van, go back up, drive the car off until the ship's done. Nobody leaves until the ship's complete. The new job came with a salary boost, double the pay of her previous job at the restaurant, benefits ranging from paid vacation to health insurance, and maybe most importantly, it vastly improved her home life. I feel like I'm always trying to find balance in my life. Balancing with working and all the kids stuff, my relationship with my husband. Every day it's like, okay, how am I gonna do this? How are we gonna get through this? Invest in you. Ready, set, grow. CNBC and Acorns.